All right, Evan Bush crouching and stretching down in front of the west side goal in front of the ultras. NYCFC gets the first touch and on its first possession. Morella is still in possession, weaves his way right, 16-42 in the ultras. Whipping themselves into frenzies, play into the box. Dangerous threat developing, shot high and wide. Morella has lost his footing right at the six yard line. See if they can slow down some of these midfield runs. Great adjustments by the coaching staff right away. The header duel won by Zaccati and Diallo for the impact as the diagonal ball was sent into the 18 yard box. Now here's a threat just inside the 18 shot. Bush save, rebound loose. Morella is there to pound it home. Goal, NYCFC grabs the lead before we've played six minutes. She's the first one to parry it out, but he parries it right into the middle, and Morales just comes in untouched and tucks it into the wide open net. It all starts with the overload on the right-hand side in the midfield, and then they switch it to the left. Bush with the initial save, and then Morales ghosts into the danger area and puts it in the back of the net. For Morales, the little man just 5'3", 115 pounds. For him, there's a Blanco Piet tight air on the left flank into New York City territory. Chipping off to the right sideline. Zachary Brogiar, nice touch on the volley, settles it down. Cross to the six, tight air, diving header wide. And it's wide right, tight air with a beautiful effort. They got an individual moment of brilliance from Omar Brownie last week. They're going to hope to do the same thing this week as he subbed on right from the start of this second half for Harry Novillo. All right, the impact are underway and grab the first possession. Crowd picking up, 16-42, picking up the decibel level. Anakin Slade is here. The inspirational rapper ambassador for the one day to be reborn Montreal Expos. Perhaps here's a left footed shot. Top corner freezes Bush. Goal New York City FC. They make it 2-0. The impact laps for a moment and it's to Jury Shradi who buries it. Humanly possible to try to get back and win the ball. Tinnerham is a He's got about 10 yards on him. Aquanko makes it up, and then it's just a sort of a, a bad bounce that gets into the box, a little deflection, and a lot of shirts of the blue in Montreal, the black and blue in Montreal, are watching the ball. Or Aquanko, down goes the New York, or excuse me, Diallo, down goes the New York City player. That's Calens, the big Peruvian. Fed forward to Aber. Aber slams on the brakes, met by Piet. Body battle, and... They wrestle a little. Here's a shot. Push diving. Save. Rebound loose. Cleared away by Samuel Piet. Great opportunity. That might have been the kill shot. In the field, he's dangerous. Brogiard gets onto the attack, and it's going to be Morales that's going to be coming out of the game for this New York City FC team. But Montreal, the loose balls are being won now by New York City FC. And right there, it looks like Ring comes all the way up from the defensive midfield position. He's got Medina spinning away. Then Roca. And New York City content to move away from the Montreal goal, sitting on a 2-0 lead. Now charging back at a shot, saved by Bush. Knocks it down, gets it back, and comes trotting out towards his 18 to swing it to Brogiar. Win Brogiar for Anthony Jackson ML, who again revives the debate. Super sub, but can he start? Here's Aber chipping Evan Bush, but it rolls wide. A wide open net, and Aber pushed it over Bush, but wide right. Not run around him. Evan Bush scoops it up at the 18, bumps into Aber, fins off, and that will do it. The Montreal Impact fall to NYCFC 2 0.